you know? Smother them when they're children. Is the idea. It also sounds horrible again. I know, I know. Now oh, we can't remove any of these. Damn it. Okay, well, I mean, what can you do? So I was just going... Construction complete. Um... Yes, come on. Bombard these guys back to the Stone Age. Does Prima Nocte really sound that bad if you're the one instituting it? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Listen, man. I've thought about this, and the new law is before you can marry anyone, I'm gonna sleep with them first. Which is like, yeah. You gotta understand. I gotta, I gotta test drive, and then things can happen. How are you gonna sell that to anyone without sounding like a mad asshole? I don't think it's really possible. Okay, I'll just move on here. Star base boost. I really wouldn't mind getting the no retreat. Special inquiry concluded. System resources analyzed. Everything's repaired over here. <clears throat> making sure they make a mistake analyzed. with their marriage. Yeah, you're creating the mistake. Yes, look at this. There's no one who can get into this you can get it who can get into this arm. That's beautiful. Oh no. Okay, so this could go wrong. Depending on how things go. The ships aren't that good apparently. It's so weird that the fire rate doesn't get calculated into the military strength. Construction oh, well. finalized. Ooh, we can research the fusion reactor here. It's probably not a bad idea. How many of these stations do they have? They have one over here too. Ah, that's already on the edge of going going wrong. Come on, boys, you can do this. At least we got their fleet routed. Anomalous readings detected. Where's the fleet manager? Yeah. Gotta rebuild. Gotta rebuild Corvettes. Come on, guys. Construction complete. We can do it. We gotta. We gotta sit in that system and kind of wait them out. Once we do this, if we can do it. Ooh. Holy hell, that's gonna be close. What the fuck? Okay, we're done with the habitable world survey. Construction complete. Sure, I guess. What? How did that happen? No, 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 no. How did that? How did that thing get? like full shields, full armor, full hull points again. How's that a thing? You saw that, right? You saw that. That thing was down, completely down a second ago. What bullshit? You gotta be shitting me. We're gonna lose this now due to this shit. That is incredible. This needed to be fixed ages ago. God damn it. Really? <sighs> I'm probably gonna send their fleet in there uh, in a second. And then, yeah, we're just getting crushed. I'm reloading this shit. Sorry, no. Just no. I'm not taking this on the chin.
Now the station is even stronger. How does that how does that happen? Guess we're gonna go back a year. It's a typical Solaris bug. I don't know. It's nonsense, is what it is. I'm not I'm not taking that. No, I'm not up for it. Can I build things in here? No. Can repair, but I can't build. That's fair, I guess. That's my replacement ship. These guys have like the defender thing. Yeah, I know that there are some people that are like using this kind of bug um, deliberately. I think it happens if you build like a new module or something there. Special inquiry concluded. You want System a resources analyzed. To take advantage of this? Maybe. The Belgium system. We'll come in here. We'll see what's what. System resources analyzed. Yeah, having picket ships in the in the fleet might not be a bad idea indeed. Let's design one real quick. So what do we take? <sighs> whoop whoop. Whoop. <clears throat> Do this. Okay. If this fleet takes losses, we're gonna add some point defense ships, I think. So the thing is, it would be nice if we could fight their fleet away from the station. Which might not be possible. But we might at least be able to strike at the fleet first to make sure that they get removed. Construction finalized. And then do the other thing. Carl's shame. We're still removing slums on Carl's shame. Anomalous readings detected. We probably have to put another holo theater on this world. Humanity is already low. Sure. Humanities on this one are also bad. Okay, let's Hostile see what that does. Reactionaries engaged. Oh, yeah, they're also using missiles, which is probably the thing here. I hope that this strategy might actually help us take out the station faster with like more of our remaining strength left, because we're uh, we're still being shot at by the station, so I guess it doesn't make that much of a difference. Okay, the fleet is gone. Now let's go into the fleet manager. And we're gonna add like a couple of PD ships. Come on, boys, you can do this. Oh, yeah, there's no 
governor in the scum sector. Can we not put someone on there? I guess I have to make this into a sector so that we can put someone on it. Okay then. The scum sector. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll take another eager dude. That's probably helpful. Let me draw a name. Okay, you gotta type exclamation mark brother to become a a governor. I guess. For now, I'm gonna let that slide. You already you're already one of our guys, Uma. And you too, Finu. <laughs> and we could have multiple people. Maybe our dwarves are not that ingenious they like this is the name of your father now it's the name of the son this should also give a couple of our specialists a job yeah look at this god damn it we drew it out a little bit but it's still that is just not good. I'm sorry. It's just not good. That is really annoying. Fleet manager. Encino? Yeah, you can be our governor. I like that you see the governor now. Welcome. The spectral clockwork. The study of pulsars seems to be an endless source of insights for our scientists, but rarely exhibit any signs of overtly dangerous phenomena. This makes the recent reports at Kaleno all the more concerning. So we have a pulsar that is emitting a beam and it is speeding up. The intervals are getting shorter and shorter. And we're going to reach a culmination at 2250. Let's see what happens then. It's like another 30 years. Where's the hair gone? I just... I shaved it off. I, I took a new job at the start of uh, May. And it just takes way too long in, in the morning to get ready if I have long hair. I have to blow dry the hair and all that kind of stuff and it just annoys me so it's not good oh, we're building ships in both ramas really oh and that starbase is not connected to the capital construction finalized it's a little bit of money might as well what's my construction ship Hey, Weemark, what up? So, how is this going? Come on, I'm gonna go mad if this if this thing resets again. Then I'm gonna be really mad. This is definitely an uphill struggle. What's new with Solaris? I've got an Xbox. Uh, the Xbox version is a little bit behind the PC version, but it's slowly getting updated. Um, for the PC version, you have the ancient relics. So things have been changed in terms of how certain anomaly chains work. You can get relics that confer um, certain bonuses. I'm actually not sure where the relics tab is. Yeah. So you can find certain things and then they give you a passive bonus and then you can also activate them. Um, sectors have been reworked. Um, Stellaris with this version is also 64-bit instead of 32-bit. So that's, that's good. Mm -hmm. 
system resources analyzed. Yeah, we really gotta rebuild our fleet before we can move into their capital, which sucks a bit. Oh yeah, we're gonna need a governor for sluggish. Together we will build a brighter future. Okay, we've got this more unity. Nice. Food processing facilities might not be a bad idea. But then again, let's just get the tar blockers so that that's done. These guys are still not happy, but let's hope that with the additional amenities, people are going to be happy. I'll do my best. Oh, you guys can't you guys can't see the war score, right? I should probably I should probably change that a little bit. Right, do something like this. Okay. I think that's better. <laughs> yeah, we're going to produce some slurm on Sluggish, for sure. Fleet is at full strength, so now we just got to wait for our guys to merge up with the thing. Okay, at least we're fully repaired. Together with the station, we should be able to fight off any attack that these guys can muster. And they still don't have uh, fleet power that is a threat to us. Which is System good. Resources Happy analyzed. I uh, can't repair this because we still don't have enough complete. pops. <sighs> oh, these ships are slowly but surely coming in. I guess we can uh, bring our troops in already. Um, you come in here, go for the research project. So this arm can't be entered from that side. That's lovely. Is slurm a thing? No, slurm is not a, it's not, it's not a thing. <laughs> well, we can imagine we're producing slurm over there. Where's my construction ship? Okay, that's happening. This place. How's the, how's the, how's the pop growth? Pop growth should actually be pretty good on this, on this place. 2.31. Planet habitability is not helping. Makes sense that that reduces the pop growth. I always found out that that is not the case. Construction finalized. Getting nothing from, or almost nothing from, from immigration. But the colony gives us plus 20%, so yeah, that's good. Hmm. It's not entirely fortunate that we're building ships over here, but we're done building them, so let's just get on with it. Once these guys die too, I think we can cut off the whole sector by taking that choke point and that choke point. Then we're pretty much set. I don't think I'm going to expand further than that. But I think taking two homeworlds should maybe push us uh, to the top of the score list. I think like score five is... like. There are four fallen empires in this, so I think we're actually the top of the regular empires at this point. Unidentified empire is going to win the game for now, but we'll, we'll be fine. We're on normal speed. Let's go up to fast speed. Make sure that things are chugging along. We should probably claim these two systems to keep the stations. I mean, that's alloys that have already been invested. It's just so expensive to make those kinds of claims. Yeah, it's probably not worth it. Alloys are easier to, to create than influence. We'll just build these again. Might not even need them in that location. How are we doing in terms of this? So 11 months until we get that one. Then we're still just one away from... Scientific progress attained. Filling one thing out. Yeah, I got the blue lasers. That's good. It doesn't really help us right now. We'd need to upgrade this whole fleet. Where can we do that? Yeah, we need to send this thing back to something with a shipyard. Which is not going to happen right now. Hey, thanks for the resub, Weemoth. Much appreciated. Ships are coming in, though. How are you looking? They're still pathetic. 
I think they went up to Inferior when we lost a chunk of our fleet, but now that we've rebuilt, things are looking better. Let me check how our designs change, because I don't think these things can actually... No, they can totally live with the power consumption of that stuff. Okay, then. Let's upgrade it. Damn it! No! Yeah, these have already been auto-upgraded. That's why. It's fine. It's fine. Hmm. We have a science ship that isn't doing anything. There's still stuff to to be surveyed over here. So let's do that. We're still busy. Anomalous readings detected. Yes, sure. Research the thing. Oh, we're almost out of consumer goods too. So let's buy some and let's throw away some of these. So where are we? Fifteen or twenty? There's one, there's three, there's... Okay, that should be all of them. Do we still have land appropriation going on here? No, we don't. Oh! You want me to take that off. That's probably not a bad idea. All things considered, what kind of planet do Together, these guys have? We will build a brighter future. Ocean world, yeah. Ooh, Corvette Hull Points. Yes. Where are we? Policy. <sighs> Slavery. Population controls. Yeah, we've got to turn off land appropriation. Although, it's not a bad thing per se. Let's do this. It's probably going to make some of our more fascist finalized. people annoy annoyed. A Star Wars pack for Xbox. That's a good Star Wars mod for. Now you think Xbox actually has a pretty good chance of getting mods in the long run? They're not as as crazy as Sony is with mods on their platform. Paradox said they can't promise anything, but they're definitely gonna try for it. Okay, yeah, we'll just move up here. I wanna I wanna close that that choke point. And I want to close the other choke point, and then I think we're fine. What's our empire sprawl at this point? Yeah, we're a little bit over. We're a little bit over. It's fine. We can we can live with this, I think. Did you guys expand? No, they did not. I mean, they took the system, but it's not going to help them. Where's my last ship? Oh, there it is. Okay. Now, should I wait for the total war? Or for like the, the no retreat? It's, it's uh, over three years. I don't think we should. I think we'll just go into sluggish. I don't think they have FTL stoppers for now, so we'll just jump in. See what we can do. Their fleet is pathetic. Unless they cheese us again with something nonsensical. Where they get all their health back, we should be fine. So what do you have? Yeah, this this should be doable. Uh, let me attack that transport fleet. I don't want these guys on the planet. Could you just finish that guy off? Construction He's... complete. Yeah. We should do a lot better against these stations now that we have the point defense though, so hoping for that. Come on, it's just one ship. Just get rid of it. 
Okay, our guy, the Strikers now has the Gale Speed trait. Awesome. That's good. It's real good. We're doing this. Unless we get cheesed by the station, we got this in the bag. System resources analyzed. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! That is total victory. So do you still have armies on the ground? Somewhat. We have some armies on the ground. Let's come down here. We can go for a bit of indiscriminate bombardment, right? That's fine. <sighs> and I just sent that ship over there. <laughs> I kind of want to have a look at the debris now. So listen. We'll do this first and then you can do the survey. Bring our army into orbit. How much strength do they have? A hundred? Ninety-eight. Yeah, we destroyed the transport fleet, which is good. Otherwise, we would have had to put a lot of work in. A weak but insistent signal transmits on repeat in the pewter system. The boost code Donok the Apogee has pinpointed its source to emanating from within the mouth of a destabilized subspace rift at the system's edge. Okay, we should stabilize that wormhole. I'm not sure if that's really a good idea, but I guess we can try. So let's build our outpost over here, close this off, fortify that system. Yeah, I know, you can see the, the accuracy for the, for the weapon types, see the effectiveness. I don't think our weapons are all that great. Consumer goods in 11 months. Hey, look at that! We actually managed to reduce the energy credits problem to minus five now. That's pretty awesome. Good, good, good. Cow's shame people here are happy now. So the available amenities actually did it. And in Tholavu's, just one pop away from, from getting the other thing up. Uh, we're looking. Yeah, we'll get there, we'll get there. How are you guys liking the- what the heck? How did that happen? Come on, really? <laughs> God damn it. Now they got like a ton of army strength out of nowhere. I guess we just gotta bombard these guys down. Uh, can I add ships to this thing? Or add troops to this? I don't think so. How many do we have? Seven. I guess Tholavu still needs to... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... 10, 1, 2, 3. <sighs> we need a proper army, I guess. There's no point suiciding my army into this now. Yeah, they're already up to 180. Oh, Construction I guess complete. we're just gonna bombard this whole planet until everyone's dead. That's okay. I can do that. If you wanna do it the hard way, I'm up for it. troops on different planets mm, it's fine it's fine scientific progress attained look at that these guys haven't removed their sprouting slums okay we've got this Ooh, 30 naval cap yes nice System resources analyzed. 